In 13 days, more than 65,000 people in Wisconsin got their first COVID shot. The governor is counting that enough of a win for his vaccine incentive program that he is extending it another two weeks to September 19th. Our investigative team is digging into the data and Naomi Coles joins us with what you should know. Naomi? The seven day average of daily doses in Wisconsin has been steadily increasing since August 23rd. A baseline here about 80,000 shots a week. Now that's when the governor announced that everyone getting their first shot will get a $100 debit card. This Tuesday, the seven day high was at 10,500 shots. That's up from again, 8,500 shots from the day of the announcement. It's been more than two months in Wisconsin since our seven day shot average was that high. But this is for sure the high water mark of the last several weeks. It still doesn't compare to the early vaccine rollout in March and April. But for state leaders, it's still something. Certainly looked hard at Minnesota, which had a similar a similar incentive program. You know, there's always that Wisconsin-Minnesota rivalry, so we'd love to be ahead of them on this. 65,000 new shots is $6.5 million so far in potential reward payouts. Money that's coming out of the state's federal COVID relief funds. There is a small lag so far in people getting their shot and then applying for the card. But registration does stay open through September 30th. Tell me a little bit about how um, DHS is verifying these applications and making sure that these applications are shots gotten since the announcement. So we will be matching the data that we see in that uh, incentive registration website with the data that we have in our Wisconsin immunization registry. I asked, what would the health secretary designee say to the people who already got their shot and now can't get the 100 bucks as well? They have been protected against COVID-19 this whole time. And we really want to say a great big thank you to the 3 million people across Wisconsin who are fully vaccinated against COVID-19. She says the incentive is for those who need just a bit more help. But because they have to hire a babysitter or they have transportation challenges, or they have to take time off of work because they don't, they don't work in a place that gives them sick time. Again, this program is for first time shots only and getting the reward is not automatic. You can check on our website at channel3000.com for the information you need to sign up. The card arrives in six to eight weeks.